everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are going to be diving in to the world of TikTok fashion. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Never did I think I would have this many videos that have to do with TikTok on my channel, but it's like every time I do one, you guys request another and I will always do something. Whatever you guys wanna see, I will do. So we're doing another one. Today we are trying like viral clothing pieces that got popping on TikTok. So to find these pieces, I went over to TikTok and I did quite a bit of research, aka just like scrolling through fashion TikToks. And also I asked you guys over on my Instagram to go and tag me over on TikTok if there were any clothing pieces that you've seen gone viral or be popular on TikTok that you wanted to see me try. And you guys helped me out a lot. You tagged me in many, many TikToks. I think my like TikTok daily usage that day was like three hours. So I was watching TikToks that day. I was TikToked out. But we were able to find a lot of fun pieces, so we're going to be diving into all of that today, and we're gonna see if it's worth the hype. Like, are all these TikTokers onto something, or are they just being crazy? I don't know. We'll see if it's worth the hype. We're going to try on a bunch of viral TikTok clothing pieces, not TikTok clothing brands, just the individual pieces that are hyped up. So let's get into that. Okay, but the first piece that we're going to try are these Amazon leggings. Apparently they just make your boot look like so good. So there's gonna be like a lot of eyes on my boot right now, which I'm not super excited about because like I don't got cake, but like whatever. I feel like this is a good test. If someone with no cake looks like they got cake, then these are definitely worth the hype. So this is the TikTok I saw that you guys take me in. It is 7.9 million views. So I've seen multiple videos on these leggings because everybody says they make your butt look bomb. Okay, so one thing too, like if you can see on the leggings, there's like ruching where your crack is. I feel like that's what's causing it. Like, I don't know, maybe it's just a mind thing. I'm not sure, but I feel like that is the culprit for if these, like it's just like. Just to get a comparison, these are Lulu's, not my favorite. And these are the, oh my God. Okay, please go buy these. The top comment on here is step one, have cake first. <laughs> and honestly, it's true. Like she's already packing. So like, of course the leggings make her look good. Okay, but then I also saw this one. If you search Amazon leggings on TikTok, so many videos come up. Like these are definitely viral on TikTok. So there was this one, which I just really liked. It was super funny, but 12 million views on this, you guys. Okay, y'all. So y'all know those leggings that have been going viral on TikTok? I'm wearing them right now, and ladies, listen closely. You need these leggings. When I say they accentuate every crease, curve, literally everything is on. Like, I don't know if I want every crease and curve to be accentuated on me. I don't know. Like, that may have sounded like a really good thing for some people, but for me, I'm like, please don't accentuate every crease. Please don't. But on the other hand, they are borderline explicit and you can literally see through them. So I cannot show you guys, but I can't show my husband. So he's on his way in right now. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get his reaction. Hey, what's up, baby? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Boo. <laughs> your booty looks juicy. <laughs> Is this Kim Kardashian or my wife? No, no, no. Boo. Why you ain't tell me to stop by the store and get some eggs? Some eggs, what? For all this cake you got back here. <laughs> Damn, I'm boy. not okay. I did not see you did. Oh my oh gosh. gosh. So yeah. <laughs> I don't have a husband, obviously, but like, I'll be able to tell, like I'll be able to see a difference, you know, go from nothing to something, we'll see. So I do in fact have those leggings here today. I have yet to unbox them. I got two types that the uh, person in the first video had tried, the like charcoal and black mesh ones, and then also the gray ones. So we will see. I'm excited to feel them. Like, I don't know. I don't wear leggings really unless I'm working out. So, um, I don't know. Okay. Okay. So the first thing that I notice is this sort of like, looks like netting material. I definitely noticed this in the TikToks, but I really, really see it now. Like it's not a flat thing, which is actually kind of nice. Maybe that fabric would help actually like hide some 
things, like instead of accentuating every crease, I feel like this fabric would hide it a little bit, which I think is kind of nice for me personally anyways. And then here is the butt ruching. This is what sets it apart, right? And then like, it's just a very thin fabric like super thin actually. Can I see through this? A little bit. Like this might be one of those ones where like you bend over and it's like, whoa, sorry everyone. Okay, so here is the first pair and then also this gray pair. Okay, this one is a little bit different. It's like a black and charcoal gray, but it all feels like the same fabric. Like this one sort of has like bigger pleats or whatever you'd call it. This is smaller. The ruching again and then a black thick band. This one also feels a little bit thicker than the gray, so these are kind of different, which is interesting because they're from the same seller, but let's try these on and see how my butt looks. Yeah, let's see. Totally want to show it. Yeah, let's look. All right, so I'm wearing sweatpants right now, so I feel like it's not going to be a very good before, but like, here's all the cake I've got to offer the world. Here it is. It's minimal. We'll see if these transform me. Let me jump into a pair. Let's start with the gray. Okay, gray leggings are on. The grand reveal. The turn. Oh my gosh. Like, it feels strange, okay? Because, like, yeah, it looks like I'm carrying some extra weight in the caboose right now. I suppose, like, they do in the Amazon ad. They're like... Hey, you wanna buy these? Wanna buy these leggings? You know that seam I was telling you guys about where it like ruches in between your butt cheeks? <laughs> it feels so weird, but I mean like you guys were curious about these legs. Like, let's get to the bottom of it. That ruching is like fully feels like a seam in between my butt. Like fully in there. But there is no denying that it looks like there's more going on than there actually is. Like it's an illusion for sure. But let's put the other ones on. Okay, these ones are like a little bit thicker. I actually feel like I prefer the make of these ones over the gray ones. I can't really tell you what's the difference or what to look for. These ones just feel thicker and they kind of like hold you in a little bit more. But do they make the boot good? What do we think? <laughs> what do you think of that there boot? It's gotta be something to do with this as well. Like this black part kind of like doing almost like an arrow down to my butt. It's like, please look here. Take your eyesight and look at the ruching. It's playing with our heads and our minds and it's working. I mean, I definitely think if you want your butt to be on display and looking extra good, I would say these leggings are a good way to do that. Like they're pretty decent. I think they do more than the average legging for sure. It's nice. Okay, this next piece that has become super popular over on TikTok, this TikTok has 10 million views. Like these are just, these views are huge. Like I can't believe how many people see these. So I have this video and then also this one up here on how to style it because honestly I was like a lingerie top, like how do I style this like in regular life? I don't know. So someone made a video on it, so thank goodness. So first I'll show you guys the top. I actually stopped shopping at Victoria's Secret but I made a small exception just to film this video so I can get this piece. And I mean, it's beautiful. So let's, let's look at the TikTok. Going to get the top from Victoria's Secret. I found it. X secured, go home. Paul, Paul, Paul. Like there's the top. That one's not it. That's not the one we're talking about. Not talking about those. That was the whole TikTok. I haven't seen this in so long. I forgot what it looked like. That has 10 million views. I mean, it's beautiful. Like, it's very pretty. Um, 10 million views, that's a lot, but okay. So I got that top, but I was like, how do I style this? Like, I'm not just gonna come out on this video, like, all out. So there's some ways to style it. This is a cute outfit. See, I like this. A white turtleneck underneath with like high-waisted jeans. I think that's probably what I'll try and do. But like there's lots of ways. Like I like that. Kind of more edgy. This. I mean, I just don't have all these clothes though. Like she has lots of nice options. I think this look will sort of be our goal. Okay, but let's take a look at the top because I haven't seen it. All right, here is the infamous 10 million views lingerie top. Here it is. Um, I mean, it's cute for sure. I keep saying it's cute. Like what else do I have to say about it? Let me actually look. Okay, so it's a zip up. All the fabric is kind of mesh with this like flower embroidery on it and then a little bit of lace up here and a cute bow. It's honestly a very adorable top. I don't know if I'd have the confidence to actually wear this as like a shirt like out 
into the universe, but we'll see with how we style it. I definitely think that styling video was very helpful because I can definitely see it now how you could do that. Let's put it on. I mean, it's beautiful. It's made well. The mesh is nice. It's not itchy. Let's try it on. All right, I didn't have a white turtleneck, so I just styled it to the best of my abilities based on that styling outfit. I kind of took from where she wore a pink skirt, so I'm wearing a pink skirt, but here is the top on. The 10 million views top. Is it worth the hype? I don't know. I personally wouldn't wear it out probably like this. I would need to layer it over something. Maybe it's just the idea of like wearing lingerie out into the universe. I just would need some layering for me personally. But this is how I decided to style it just to show it off. I feel like this is very cute. I could see myself like running through a field in this. I think the top is worth the hype, but what I needed in my collection Probably not. And that's where I'm gonna leave that. Okay, this next piece is actually what inspired this video. I saw this on my For You page and I was just like, what? Like, Gap jeans? Okay, so let's see. I literally do not care what you're doing right now. If you're looking for new jeans to buy for Christmas, you need to please, please, please watch this video. I promise. Like, I was like, what? Oh my goodness. Like, she's like begging me to watch because these jeans are so good. I'm like, Okay, what is it? After wearing these jeans, I probably will never buy any other brand of jeans because they're actually amazing. They are the Gap Cheeky Straight High Rise Jeans. I have these in the dark and these in the light. My size kind of varies between like 6 to an 8, sometimes even a 4, and I'm 5'7", so I bought these in the 6 tall and they fit phenomenally. Let me show you. So here they are, 6 tall. They go perfectly to my ankles, they're amazing. So they're usually $70, and right now they're on sale for 31, it kinda depends on the color, but these ones that I have on now are $31. Trust me, you need to buy them. Like, I oh my goodness. Okay, and then that video got 790,000 views. So I would say that video did in fact blow up. So I went ahead and got these jeans. I was like enticed by this because I don't think I have, like I think I have one pair of Gap jeans from the thrift store and that's it. And I mean, I really like them. They fit me like a glove. So I was like, okay, what are we talking about? Like Gap jeans fitting beautifully. You're literally like saying so intensely, these are the best jeans ever. So I went to their website and oh my goodness, when something's talked about on TikTok, it sells out. So it was really hard to find a style that like was in my size. But sure enough, I found this darker denim of the same style she was talking about and it's got rips in it. So it wasn't the pair she was wearing, but it's the same style, just a different like color, I guess. And here they are. I also got them in a tall. Oh right, I had to get them in a 27. So that's like a size four, I think. And I usually wear a size like one or two. So they're gonna be too big, I think. But I've been trying to buy my jeans too big because I've noticed that I like don't like tight jeans. Like I'd rather them almost falling off than too tight. So these should be perfect for that. Here they are. They're like a medium wash a denim. And then they've got the holes here. I was, it's so weird. The other day I was literally like, can you believe it that like skinny jeans are like going out of style. When did that happen? Like my whole closet is skinny jeans. When did this happen? I mean, I wear sweatpants, but like the jeans I do have, I feel like they're all like skinnier. This style of jean I feel like is super popping right now. So I'm happy to have a pair. I don't know how they'll look. I mean, they feel nice. They don't have like too much stretch to them though. They feel like a pretty tight denim. Like I would say a little stretchier than like a Levi denim if you've ever felt those. So let's put them on and see how they look. See if they were honestly worth the hype. Okay, I am like pleasantly surprised with these. Now I will say because they are two sizes too big, I have quite a bit of gapping, gap, gap jeans are gapping at the back, but I would probably just cinch this with a belt or maybe do that TikTok trick where they like tie a like shoelace or something. I don't know. I'll go to TikTok to fix my TikTok pants with a TikTok trick. But these are actually so comfortable. Like initially I was thinking that they weren't super comfortable because they felt very strong denim. But now that I have them on, they definitely have some decent stretch to them and they are truly like that popular style, like where it's just super straight. This is definitely like Gap, you did good with these. And I like the cuts. Oh. And I did get these in tall. I'm five foot five. I think if you got regular, they would be like a three quarter or like a little bit shorter. But I definitely think getting the tall is pretty important. It helps the style 
a lot. I want to throw in a belt just to see how it looks. Okay, with the belt, the gapping is pretty well solved. I mean, this probably isn't the belt I would wear with it, but like, I like these and I've been wanting a pair of jeans this style and I definitely think these are worth the hype. I really, really like them and like, I think I got them when they weren't on sale, but if they were on sale, I'd say they're a really good deal too. Okay, this next piece is leggings again, but these leggings are very different. So I guess this is the video that it got popular off of, I think, from what I have seen, like I'm not an expert on TikTok, but like I did look around quite a bit. And this is 7.4 million views. This is the video. So everyone like obviously doing things, but like everybody was just like locked on the leggings. So all the comments are talking about the leggings. Just ordered some leggings, they're on sale right now. Go get some airy real me high-waisted crossover leggings. The way you single-handedly sold out these leggings across the country, like, this video sold out these leggings. So insane. Okay, but then I saw this video, which actually has more views than the original video. Like this one has 9 million views. So once they actually called out the leggings, it got more views. And sure enough, she loves them. She wants you to go get them. That's what I did. I went and got them. Thank goodness. <laughs> thank I feel so stupid saying thank goodness. Like, thank goodness I could get these leggings. Phew. But they were not sold out here in Canada. They had the black pair available. The rest of them were sold out, which was too bad because I wanted like the charcoal pair. But I mean, black's good. It goes with everything. So here are those leggings. Let's see them. Like I said, I'm not a legging wearer. I just feel like... I don't know, they're comfy and everything. I just feel like I don't really look good in leggings. So I haven't really been too keen to wear them, but I mean, these are an exciting pair. They got a lot of attention, so there must be something about them that's great. So I went ahead and got them in a small long. Uh, I'm five foot five, but I like to get things long because my legs seem to take up a good portion of my body. So here they are at the top. It's the crossover legging because there's like a little spot that like crosses over. It's probably hard to see because it's a black fabric. These definitely, feel thinner than like a Lululemon legging, but also very, very good quality, like an athletic fabric for sure. Very interested to see how these look on. I have no idea what I'm going to think of these. And now we'll be trying two different types of leggings, the Amazon ones and now these. So let's just put them on and see. Like, did they cinch my waist? I'm not sure. I doubt it. All right, you guys, the airy leggings are on. First thing, just before I forget, I think that to not order along, they would be a little bit short because I don't think I normally need a long pant. I mean, I usually do order it because I like it to go right to my ankle, but I think without ordering long, these would have been too short for me. So if you're ordering for yourself, just know that. These might be the softest leggings I've ever put on. Like they are so nice. Nothing like any other leggings I've ever worn. Like my Lululemon leggings definitely are soft and like, but they hold you in. These are more just like really soft. Like they almost feel like, like a slippery satin material. So yeah, the fit is great. The comfort's great. This is like the high-waisted part with this like layering bit, these two fabrics right here if that makes sense like see my hand it looks like it's going into a pocket it's just another layer the thing we all want to know is does it make my waist look tiny because it goes up so high and it like points inward like this and I'm really trying to overanalyze like I'm looking in the mirror I'm like okay what do I think like it looks like I'm like eight feet tall I think because they go up so high it does show off my hip dips a little bit which I don't mind to be honest like that doesn't bother me like that's just how my body is built I think that maybe it does give a little bit of an illusion of a snatched waist because of this angle I like them here they are on me what do you think are they good are they worth buying I definitely think I'll wear them because they are literally so comfortable I like them thanks TikTok okay last but certainly not least I found this TikTok it has 600,000 views. I just wanted to show you guys this dress. It's like, actually, it's hot and a skirt. I'm not getting sponsored or anything. To do. I just, I can't believe how good this looks. I have absolutely nothing so to say. So that was it, basically. So apparently this set, okay, well, initially she said it was a dress, but it's actually a two-piece. It's a skirt and a top, and apparently it cinches in all the right places. It's kind of like a corset-style top, and then a ruched skirt that, like, builds out the hips. So I don't know. I mean, I got it. We'll see. It is beautiful. I don't know where I'd wear it. It's literally snowing outside, but, like, I want to see. It is sold on Pretty Little Things website. 
bag is loud in one second. Okay, so here is the top. It's the exact one from the video with the orange and blues in here. Very pretty, nice and soft. Definitely not the fabric I thought it was gonna be. It's a lot thinner and it feels very like satiny. And then here is the skirt with the ruching. It feels great. Like, I don't know how it's gonna look on me. Is orange my color? I'm not sure, probably not, but we will see. I will put it on and we will judge it when it's on. Okay, I know this is the last piece that we're trying, but I also think this is probably my favorite find from TikTok. I don't know where I'd wear it. I don't know when I'd wear it but I'm obsessed with it. Like this is everything. I love this ruching too. Like if you wanna fake having some booty going on, like here's the way to do it. I love this style. I think that she was totally right. It's hugging the curves like with this corseted top, which by the way, isn't like a real corset. It's just a zipper and like it's not super tight, but it definitely like, I don't know, gives illusion. Like it's so tight here and then it starts ruching and everything. I love that it looks like it's one piece, but it's actually two pieces. Like, I don't know. I feel like there are so many different places you could wear this. This is so cute. I love this. I definitely think this was my favorite find off TikTok. But those are all of the pieces that we have to try today. Make sure to let me know down below which was your favorite or if there are any other viral pieces that you've seen on TikTok, link them down below and we can do a part two. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!